Hello, everyone. Thank you for joining us on this Wednesday and welcome to this educational presentation. Now, I'm really excited to be introducing a brand new course, Specialist Trading's Buy Low, Sell High College. This is a brand new college course that we're uh, just for the very first time making known to the public. And we feel that a lot of traders are really going to be interested in this because it's really about the best of the best of three particular indicators. Now, let me share with you an older chart here. It's actually a weekly chart in gold. Okay, this is going up to October of last year. Now, a lot of traders looking at this would say, well, gold is in a downtrend. Steve says to, you know, if we're going down to sell. But what I'm going to be teaching you in the college course is you would have known right here that this was a very significant area that there was a high probability we were bottoming out and that you should look to buy right here. And then right there at the end of last year, gold started to go up. So this is what we're going to be focusing on in the college, how to pinpoint and identify these lows that are high probability setups. Now, this also works the other way. If we look at this older chart in eBay, all right, it's been going up. This is a daily chart. It's been going up. But what I'll teach you in the college is a particular pattern where it would have significantly said that there's a chance that this is topping out and this should be sold. And as we see right here, you could have sold at or near the highs. So this is what's going to be offered and taught in the college. And that's what we're going to be introducing today. This is our new buy low, sell high college. So welcome once again. My name is Stephen Primo, president and founder of Specialist Trading. Thanks once again for joining us. Uh, if you're interested in really looking to buy at the low or sell at the high, this is the college for you. You know, a lot of students have, uh, you know, taken our courses, they purchased our particular strategies or techniques or indicators. And they said, Steve, they're, they're fantastic. They're great. They really helped me. But I'm the kind of trader that likes to buy at or near the low and sell at or near the high. And I've often said, well, that's almost impossible to do. I've been trading for nearly 50 years now. And I very rarely know of a lot of traders who are able to pick the very bottom tick to buy and the top tick to sell. But there are ways to get very close to that. And so because of a lot of traders and students telling us that this is what they're really interested in, this is why we formulated this college, Pro Trader Strategies and Specialist Trading, for those specific traders that want to take advantage of these high probability areas. And we're going to just going to be focusing on the best of the best. These are the indicators that are designed to identify these extreme lows or these extreme highs so that you can either buy or sell. So we're really excited about this because this is different from anything we've ever presented before. It's not an actual strategy. It's not a technique. We're really just talking about the best indicators we have for this particular type of trading. Now, before I get into it and show you some examples of what we'll be teaching and also go through the curriculum, please take a moment to view our disclaimer. I'm going to show you a lot of performance results using what's going to be taught in the college, but please remember that we can in no way guarantee that any of the results I'm about to share with you will be repeated in the future. And please remember that since we are first and foremost an educational company, all examples are strictly for educational purposes only. Now, if you'd like to get more education on a daily basis, please feel free to follow us on Twitter. There's our handle right there, abbreviation for specialist training. Every day I post anywhere from four to six different snapshots of signals or uh, techniques that have generated signals uh, and I show you how exactly uh, they were generated and show you what was behind uh, that particular method. I also post different bits of uh, financial wisdom. So there's lots of great free education on a daily basis. So please feel free to follow us on Twitter. Now, as I said in the opening statements, we are first and foremost an educational company. We're not going to sit here and tell you today or in our college courses what we think the market's going to do. We're not going to tell you what the best stocks are to buy or sell or what market you should be trading or even what time frame you should be trading. It's our philosophy that those are things that have to be determined by you. You see, everyone comes in carrying different risk parameters, different ways in which to trade. Someone can get the exact same signal as someone else and come up with two different uh, results. And that's OK, because we want you to be a part of the process. So as an educator, as a mentor, my goal is not to force feed you signals the way so many other websites do. My goal is simply to teach you how to trade with the specialist edge. Now, when I was struggling some 46 years ago on the floor of the stock exchange, this is the same technique and this is the same concept that my mentors taught me and what I truly believe has sustained me now going on 46 years. And hopefully it will be able to do the same for you. And that's what we're going to be focusing on today and as well 
in the new college that we're going to be presented. Okay, so with that out of the way, let's begin. And we're going to be talking about this particular buy low, sell high course. But who is this course for? Because not every course is for everyone. I mean, some people like to trade different ways. Some people have different styles. So traders who want to buy at the most opportune and least expensive prices. All right, now we know everyone wants to buy at the most opportune and least expensive prices. But a lot of traders will buy that way or trade that way, but then they'll also trade other ways. There are a number of specific traders who only want to trade that way. They want to say, listen, I'm willing to wait for a low inexpensive price, and I'm willing to wait for a high probability setup that is at the very lows or near the very lows, okay? That's also for traders who want to sell at the most opportune and most expensive prices. Let's say you're along a position and you don't really know where to get out. And you're saying to yourself, okay, I've got a nice profit here, but gosh, last time I got out too soon. And then one other time I held on too long and then it turned around. How do I know when to get out at the most opportune and the most expensive price so I can grab as much profit as possible? Now, this course is also for traders who want to enter a trade with as little risk as possible. I mean, the reason being is that once you get into a trade, let's say you buy at or near the lows. If the trend turns around and goes the direction you want it to go, well, your risk will be very low, will be very minimal because you will be buying towards the lows and most likely it won't go that direction anymore. All right. So you want as little risk as possible. Now, this is also for traders who want to exit a trade with as much profit as possible. Remember, once again, traders have a difficult time exiting. They'll get into a trade. They don't know exactly how to get out. And a lot of them will leave a lot of profit on the table. But what if I could tell you that with what we're going to be teaching in the college, you can trade and try to squeeze out as much profit as possible with specific techniques we'll be teaching you. Now, this is also for traders who like to go short at or near the highs. Now, we have a number of traders who really don't like to short any of the markets, but we also have a number who do. In fact, we have some students who only go short the markets. This, is, this course is going to be perfect for them because we're going to teach you a number of techniques that really pinpoint these highs with high probability. So you have very minimal risk and you'll be able to get at it or near the top at good short end. Now, this course is also for traders who want to time their trades with precision. In other words, they want some type of element of structure to their trades. So many times, I'm sure you've gone through it. I mean, when I was on the floor, I used to do this. I'd be watching a stock where the market goes straight down and I'd say, okay, now it's going to change. I just base it off a feeling and I jump in and buy. It would go up maybe for a little bit and then go straight down even more. And there was no precision to that. Same way when it went up, it would go up tremendously. Somebody would say, hey, this is so overbought. Man, we've never seen these highs before. So you just sell off a whim thinking that it's got to it's got to roll over, right? But there was no precision. There was no structure and it would keep going higher. So with these, you're going to actually have structure and precision and know exactly where to enter and where not to enter. And it's for traders who want to trade options. This course is ideal for option traders. The reason being is that if you're thinking of going long at a very low or inexpensive price, it stands to reason that the option is going to be very inexpensive. You're not going to have to pay a lot for the premium, right? And uh, with, with all the leverage involved in options, you stand to make an, a really nice profit if it does go in your direction and you pick the bottom. Same way if you pick the top, if you buy some puts or if you have a, a spread strategy with a, a downward bias, if you get in at or near the highs, well, the, uh, the premiums are going to be very low. And this is perfect for trading with options, okay? And then lastly, this course is for traders who want to scan for nightly setups. The beauty of this course is that we've constructed a scan uh, area where everything is one-stop shopping, where you don't have to go on the platform and look for different scans and come up with your own individual scans. Everything's going to be right there for you for a buy low, sell high scan. All these different tools and techniques and methods I'll be teaching in the course have a scanning area, a scanning page where you can go to each one and scan nightly to look for these setups. So you see, everything is right there for you. The education, the teaching, the scanning. All you have to do is attend the college, become a student behind the college, and you'll learn all these different techniques. 
No, no. A lot of you are saying, but Steve, you always say to never pick tops and bottoms. I've attended all of your classes and some colleges you had in the past, and you're always preaching that you should never try to pick a top or a bottom. And that's true. And that goes the way most traders trade tops and bottoms, which is based off no structure, no idea, and just based off a whim or discretion, the way I just described, the way I used to trade when I first started trading on the floor. But let me share with you those first two examples we looked at. Okay. Remember, this is an older chart. This one was in eBay. All right. Now, what I'll be teaching in the course actually identified a pattern that was a topping pattern that had a high probability that the trend was going to change and it was a good place to sell. And it actually worked out pretty well because all of a sudden eBay went straight down. Okay. But someone said, but yeah, but you're saying not to pick tops and bottoms. Well, let's look at where this area actually was right here. Okay. If we look down at the date on our platform, it was in August of 2022, just about a year ago. All right. Now we're looking at eBay. Let's go back a little bit and look at a broader chart and go back roughly a year or two. All right. Now we can see that eBay has been in an overall downtrend. And look at where that signal was that we talked about right here. Okay. So actually what we're doing is we're selling the high, but in an overall downtrend. At the limited space we're looking at on the chart, it looks as if we're trying to pick a top. But if we go back and spread out the chart a little bit, we'll see that the overall trend is still down. Or how about this weekly chart of gold, all right? This is going back where we had a really high probability uh, pattern that I'll be teaching in the course that said that most likely this is going higher and that you should buy here because this is a buy low area. And then on a weekly time frame, gold went straight up coming into uh, mid-year of this year. But let's spread this chart out a little bit more. Let's go back, let's say, a couple of years because this was October of 2022. Let's go back to 2019. And if we go back starting there, we see that gold has been in an overall uptrend. And that buy that we purchased was actually right here. So we're buying the low in an overall uptrend. So this is what we're looking at. According to our parameters and our indicators that we'll be using, we're actually in an overall uptrend or an overall downtrend. Now, it's not as easily seen as we just saw right here. A lot of times we'll teach you something in the college and you'll go back and say, well, it doesn't seem to be in an overall uptrend here. But according to our parameters and the indicators, yes, we are buying or selling in overall trends. So we're not just blindly without any discretion, we're just kind of just jumping in and saying, I think it's gone up too high the way you would possibly right here and say, it's tremendously overbought and you sell thinking that we're kind of stopping here and then it goes higher. We need a little bit more precision, a little bit more structure than doing that. Now, which tools or indicators will be featured in this course? Well, here's the good news. We are going to be featuring our best of the best toolbox. These are the best tools we feel, Pro Trader Strategies and myself, that we've developed that really have the highest probability for finding these lows and finding these highs. You know, we have other indicators that really aren't designed to do that. They're more designed to trade in continuation with the trend. We have strategies, we have indicators, we have methods that really want to buy once something has started to go up or once something has started to go down, then they sell. But we don't have a lot of things that have been developed to look for these lows or for these highs. But we have three of our best that actually have a really high capability of doing that. And so this is what's going to be offered in the college. Let's start off with indicator number one, because they're all indicators. They're not strategies. They're just indicators that we're going to be presenting in the college. And these are all indicators that we've already had colleges on. They, each and every one of them has had their own course. They've had their own uh, uh, classes their own uh, private classes and uh, private course rules. But we're bunching them all together because they're the best of the best. And the first one is the PTS XT. This is the extreme trend indicator. Now, this is a little bit different from the other indicators that we'll be presenting in the college in that its job is really not to define where a low is or where a high is. Its job is to identify when an extreme trend is about to take place. But oftentimes that will happen at or near low or at or near high. So that's why we've included this particular indicator in the college. For example, if we look at this uh, chart in AVGO, not much is happening here. Just in this small little area, we're not doing anything. 
we apply the PTSXT, which is basically either puts a yellow block or a red block around the bars. And if you see a yellow block, that's telling you to buy. And look what happened. 270 points in the next couple of weeks, okay? So even though that may not have been the bottom, it was at the bottom uh, of the uh, trend before it took off. 275 points, that's a nice place to get in. Or we can have smaller gains to the downside. Here's a chart in AIG, all right? Doesn't look like much is happening once again. We click on the PTSXT indicator, and now we have a reddish orange block around the price. This is telling us that pretty much we've topped out, a very high probability that we're not going to be going any higher. So even though it's not as, uh, as well-defined as a bottom or topping uh, pattern or indicator, it really is a great indicator for telling us that most likely we're going to have a big run in that direction. And look what happened. Straight down 15 points. And this, this once again, this is an inexpensive stock. So this is a good percentage or roughly about 20%. It just lost in a couple of weeks. And this was the top before the bottom fell out. How about this example? There's a weekly chart in NVDA video, okay? Once again, it was just kind of basically going sideways at the beginning of the year on a weekly time frame, But all of a sudden on this week, there was a yellow box around this particular bar. That's telling us if this goes up extremely high the way it's most likely positioned to do, this will be the bottom. This will be where you want to get in. And as you can see, it was looking all the way up until this last month, that was the bottom of that big run. And that's where you should have gotten in. That's why we've included this in the college. And then lastly, we look at HE. This just happened a couple of weeks ago. All right. Not much is happening in the stock, kind of drifting sideways to lower, but a red orange block was uh, uh, displayed around this particular bar. And if it does go down, well, that will be the top. And that's where you want to get in. And look what happened. It fell 27 points in the next couple of weeks coming into this past week. OK, so this is why we're including this, even though it's not designed and developed to pick tops or bottoms. We see that in hindsight, if it does go in an extreme trend, that very first bar that's either in uh, red, as you see here, or in yellow is going to be the, either the top or the bottom of the run. And that is why we've included it in the buy low, sell high college. So that's indicator number one. Let's go on to indicator number two. And this is another popular one you've heard me talk about so many times, something that I, I took from my days on the floor of the exchange and something I developed with ProTrader Strategies. It's the PET-D, the Primo Early Trend Detector. I trade with this every day and I use this for intraday trading my own markets. But we found that there are a number, numerous ways to apply this for looking for tops and bottoms. In fact, in the college, this will this indicator will actually get the most attention because there are roughly about two or three specific patterns using the PET-D that are really highly attuned to identifying bottoms and tops. For example, let's look at Apple. This is going back to the beginning of the year. All right, this is just a standard blank chart. Once we apply the color bar tool, the PET-D, we see that it changes the colors of the bars either to red or to green. Red meaning a downtrend, green meaning an uptrend. Now, just because we have enough green bars here does not mean that that's where you jump in. It does not say that we're bottoming out. It doesn't give you any information. It just tells you at that moment, this wants to go higher, okay? Now it may go higher for another couple of bars. It may go straight down after on the next bar. We don't know. It's just telling us at that time on a tick by tick basis, what the market wants to do. It's a short term trend identifier. But as I stated, there are a number of ways to apply it. And through our research, we have found there is a number of specific patterns that give us a little bit more information than just looking at the red or green bars. For example, a pattern that I will be teaching in the college right here is a bottoming pattern. That's where you should be buying. And look what happened. 65 points coming into August right here. OK. Now, the same pattern can be looked at. For tops, here's an example in CE, uh, C, S -E -E, okay, Sealed Air Corporation. Once again, it's been going higher, but when we add the PET D, we see we have a number of green bars followed by a number of red bars. Now, simply because they're red does not mean, well, we've got to sell. This is a common mistake that most students make. Remember, this is not a strategy. It's not a system. Just because you see a number of red bars does not mean, well, we sell at the market or a number of green bars, we buy at the market. It's just telling you what the market wants to do. You have to add some structure. 
Now, the structure we're using is, is a specific pattern that I'll be teaching you in the college. And that, that pattern was identified right here. And then look what happened. Okay. Fell out of bed, 10 points, roughly about, uh, once again, 25%. Let's look at UPS. Now, someone looking at this would say, well, Steve, this is a high level consolidation. I mean, you're a technician. You see here that we have a nice run up and we're just kind of going sideways before we break out to the upside. Well, maybe, but if we add the pet D, let's see if it gives us any more information. Well, not really. I mean, we have a splash of red here, some more green, some more red. But if we know this pattern, which I'll teach you in the college, it was identified right here and Look what happened, it fell 15 points. So there are a number of ways to use this. This is just one pattern. Here's another, another pattern in CVS that happened at the end of last year, okay? I'll be teaching you this pattern as well because right here, we see that we started to go higher and this pattern was identified right here where the majority of the bars were green, but it was a topping pattern and CVS fell 35 points after that was identified. Remember, it's not the pet D that's telling us, it's a pattern uh, along with the pet D. Also, the same pattern was here in Tesla. We see right here that we had the pet D. And once again, we had some red, we have some green, another red. Someone would say, hey, that's a bearish engulfing pattern. We've got to sell, right? But that was this bottoming pattern once again. And it went up. So you have a really nice buy area right here towards the lows. And you could have taken advantage of this. Now, some would say, well, yeah, that's great, Steve. But you know what? Look what happened after this. Now I see another red bar. So this is probably telling me I got to get out, right? Not necessarily because we didn't see that pattern yet. And it went up even higher. So potentially you could have captured 120 points. We're not saying you would, but you would have had a nice profit. Once again, you see how your risk was minimal. If you would have bought somewhere around here, it didn't go any lower than that. So your risk is very low. But now look what happened. Once we got into the end of July coming into this month, we have a number of red bars. And what do we see here? Now we see that same pattern, but now in the opposite direction. Now it's time to sell. And look what happened, 45 points coming into a couple of weeks ago to the downside. So you'll be learning exactly how to apply this and many other patterns. And now we come to the third and final indicator, which we'll be teaching in the, in the course. And I feel this is the best of the best, of the three best, because this is really specifically designed to find those lows and to find those highs. And this is our brand new tool I developed, ProTrader Strategies. It's the PSBI, or the Primo Secret Breakout Indicator. We've had some rave reviews from our students and customers who have purchased this. It's relatively new. There's still a lot of people that don't have it. That's why we're including it in this. And it's really seen some really phenomenal results with some of the uh, signals that's been generated lately. All right, so let's take a, a look at Amgen, all right? Now, this is cut and dry. It's not as subjective as looking for a pattern or uh, you know waiting to see if you have a number of green or red bars. This is very simple. This will uh, display a color block around an area that it is saying is a buy area, that is saying is a bottoming area. And in this case, you see right here, this is the block right here. So we'll teach you a very highly opportune place in which to buy in that block. And look what happened. Now, looking back in hindsight, wouldn't you have wanted to buy there near the lows? You could have potentially captured 45 points in Amgen. Now, that was in June. Let's look at Pepsi. All right. Pepsi is in a nice uptrend, higher highs, higher lows. But if we apply the PSBI, we see now that we have that kind of a reddish magenta block, which is a sell block telling us that we've most likely topped out. This is a highly opportune place, not guaranteed, like all the indicators are not guaranteed, but very high probability place that most likely we've topped out. This was just uh, two or three weeks ago. And the stock fell 15 points coming into the last week of August, okay? Here's another example, SPLK. Kind of going lower to sideways, not much to tell us here, but if we apply the PSBI, we see right here on the 22nd and 23rd of August, we had that turquoise block telling us that this is a buy area, that we are at or near the lows. And look what happened the next couple of days. All right. Obviously, some news happened where it gapped up 16, 17 points. It's funny how none of this is based off fundamental news or information or announcements. 
None of this. It's all based off market behavior and indicators, proprietary tools and indicators that we put together to formulate the PSBI, as well as the PETD, as well as the PTSXT. So nothing is based off of news. But isn't it interesting how two days before this gapped up, most likely on some news, this gave you a buy signal right at or near the lows in SPLK. And let's look at this uh, example in Dollar Tree, okay? The stock had been going straight up. If you had tried to short here, thinking that, well, we've topped out, we're really overbought, look what happened, it went up even higher. But the PSBI waited until this point right here to tell you that we are at or near a high point, that this is a place that if you're long to exit, or if you're thinking of going, going short, like some of our students, this is a good place to get short. And look what happened. Fell 27 points. And then once again, we see that big gap down to the downside based off news. But this was telling us well in advance, roughly almost a month ago, to exit the stock. So this is why we say out of all the three, even though they're all tremendous indicators, this one is the best of the best, the best of the three, because it really is designed to find these highs and these lows. Now, you'll learn in this course that there's one thing all of these indicators have in common, and that's what separates them from the rest. That's why we included them within this college, because there's one thing that separates them. You Sure, we could have added another tool or something, but it really wouldn't fit the bill. It wouldn't have that high probability for consistency the way these three do. And the one reason is, well, we'll teach you that in the course. Now, let's go through the curriculum, okay? We're going to cover the philosophy and concepts behind buying low and selling high. Remember, it's really not our nature to teach anything just to blatantly buy because we think it's too low or blatantly sell something because we think it's, it's overbought. You have to have structure. You have to have some type of discipline and knowing in what you're doing. You can't just blindly jump in. And we'll go over that in our philosophy and the concepts behind these three indicators. And then we'll dive into the first indicator. We'll show you how simple it is to apply and show you examples that are very current with the PTS XT. Okay, this is our extreme trend indicator. After we go through that and show you how simple it is to apply, we'll also share with you those uh, patterns within the PET D color bar directional tool. Remember, the PET D will probably spend the most time with because. The PET D actually doesn't signal anything. It's just basically telling you, as I said, with a color bar at the moment, what the market wants to do. It may change on the very next bar. But if you know how to identify these specific patterns, well, then you have added now some structure. And these patterns are akin to finding these lows for buying areas and to finding these highs for selling areas. So we'll send, spend some time with the PET D. Then we'll move over to what I feel is really my favorite, and that's the PSBI, the Primo Secret Breakout Indicator. As I stated, this is relatively new. We only introduced this to the public a little over a month or so ago, and we've gotten some rave reviews, and it's really a good tool to use, and especially if you're the type of trader that likes to look for tops and bottoms. And we're going to throw in a bonus, all right? A never-before-seen exiting technique. Now, this is a combination of these indicators, and this is something we found in our research that is a great, great way to exit at or near the highs. This is probably one of the most common questions I get from students. They'll say, you know, Steve, your stuff works really well. I just, I either leave too much on the table, I get out and it keeps going higher, or I hold on too long and I give away a lot of my profits by thinking it's gonna come back higher and then it's, it tops out. So this is a great tool that we've seen that works fantastic with not only you know, uh, buying tops and bottoms, with, with anything that you're currently trading. And this is great for squeezing out as much profit as possible you have within a trade. We're also going to add one more bonus. This is our scanning process. We are going to develop a page that is just directly uh, attributed to all the uh, different indicators and different studies you'll be learning in the buy low, sell high college. So it'll all be one-stop shop and you won't have to go anywhere else on the platform to look for a scan. It'll be right there. It will be the buy low, sell high scanning page. So anything we taught you in the course, you'll be able to scan immediately and look for these setups.
Now remember, it's not just enough just to scan. We want you to know the process behind all of these. But once you fully understand the process, it'll be as easy as just scanning. You can scan any market you like, the NASDAQ, the S&P 500, ETFs, currency pairs, because remember, what we're going to be teaching you works on all these markets. These indicators are not based on anything in particular that has to do with stocks or anything particular that has to do with commodities. It's based on market and price behavior. And so the PTSXT doesn't know if it's looking at uh, you know, Apple or it doesn't look, know if it's looking at crude oil. You know, the uh, PSBI doesn't know if it's looking at the Australian dollar or if it's looking at uh, cryptos. It makes no difference. So you can apply these to any market and in any time frame. Now, these methods can be applied once again to stocks and ETFs, futures, forex, commodities, and cryptos. So that's the beauty of this. You don't have to purchase a, a, an entirely different method because you trade maybe two or three different markets. You can use this on any market and any time frame. For example, let's look at an ETF here. Here's a weekly chart of the QQQs. That's the ETF that represents the NASDAQ, all right? Now, obviously, this has been going straight up. This is a weekly chart starting in 2020 when we had that big run after the pandemic going all the way up to 2022, last year, okay? Now, what I'll be teaching you in the college, once again, with the PET-D is a particular pattern that signals some type of topping area right here. So with this in mind, you either could have sold a long position or said, you know what, I'm invested in the market. I think I'll get out. And that would have been a wise idea because the NASDAQ fell 120 points. Now, here's the beauty of that pattern, because it not only identifies tops, it also identifies bottoms. And look at the pattern right here. OK, so that was identifying now a bottom time to get back into the NASDAQ. And since uh, November, December of 2022, it's been actually long the NASDAQ on a weekly basis. So this is what, once again, you'll be learning. Here's an ETF. How about currency pairs? All right. Here's the Australian dollar. Going back to about a month ago at the end of July, a PSBI sell signal was generated here right at the top of this run. And look what happened. It fell 375 pips coming into uh, mid to the end of this month, August. All right. So that's on the downside. Now, what about the upside? Well, here's a chart of the dollar yen. The PSBI generated a buy setup right here in mid-July, just based off that color bar chart. And look what happened, 700 pips coming into mid-August. So as we said, it makes no difference what market, what time frame. You can apply these to all these different aspects of trading. Now, if you go to my website or if you go to the Pro Trader Strategies website, you'll see a number of testimonials from our past colleges, colleges we've had on courses like uh, strategy number four or the pet D and you'll see a lot of the really nice, amazing testimonials of people that really it helped a lot and became consistent. In fact, these could be traders that are just learning for the very first time. We also have traders that were uh, also involved in hedge funds. This is a hedge fund trader that took one of our courses as well. So we have a really good reputation for really educating traders, regardless of how long they've been trading, their experience level or their knowledge or even their account size. It makes no difference. Everyone gets the same information. Remember, as a mentor, my goal is to pass this information to you so that you can elevate your own trading. Remember, it doesn't do anything if I just say, well, we're going to spit out nightly signals and there's nothing you really need to do except enter these orders. Because that means you're not part of the process. And that means you most likely will fail. 85% of all traders fail. And I believe the number one reason is because they're not a part of the process. You're giving your uh, power away to someone to decide for you. You have to be educated, learn these things that have high probabilities. Remember, nothing is guaranteed. Nothing is written in stone that it will work 100% of the time. All you want to do is put the odds in your favor. Give yourself an edge. And the buy low, sell high college can really give you that edge and put the odds in your favor. Okay, so let's break it down because these live classes are going to start very soon. It's going to be live classes just like this, but it'll be more intimate. There won't be a large, large class. When we first started doing these colleges, we've had hundreds of people in the college. We're going to keep it to a minimum because it's more intimate. You can ask questions. You don't have to feel uncomfortable if you don't understand something. And it's a lot easier to teach with a smaller crowd than talking to 200 or 300 people. Okay. So remember, we're going to focus entirely at entering at lower prices and exiting on higher prices. 
These are three of our best of the best indicators. I know many of you students probably already have maybe one or two of them. That's okay. Pro Trader Strategies is willing to work with you on the price. Now, you're going to be able to keep risk to a minimum because of the structure and the way these uh, setups are designed. If you get in at the low or at the high, and if the trend changes in your direction, well, the, you most likely you won't lose anything. As we all know, the worst thing in the world to do is to buy something. And the minute we buy it, it goes the opposite direction, right? Or the minute we sell something, it goes the opposite direction. Well, if we're actually going to be having a high probability of buying near the lows, most likely it won't go any lower. That'll be it. And you will have very little risk, okay? This also makes it ideal for option trading. Your premiums will be much lower and it'll be much easier to have much larger gains. But you can apply it to all markets, all time frames, and you'll have nightly scanning ability as well. You can scan for all of these things we'll be teaching, okay? Plus, you're going to get that high probability exit te technique that we've never taught before, never even shared with anyone before. We found this in our research a while ago, and we've been saving it, and this is a great place to use it because it's a great technique that if you are in a trade that has a really nice profit, this will squeeze out the best gains you can think of, okay? Now, we know that everything you just saw was displayed coming from our platform, the platform I developed with Pro Trader Strategies, the PTS Primo charting platform that actually teaches you how to buy and identify these lows and to sell these highs. You just, if you decide to become a course member of the college, we're going to throw in a full 12 months free so that you can scan for these and look at these, all of these setups. Remember, you can only see these uh, scanning availability and a lot of the setups using the PTS Primo charting platform. So if you decide to come on board, you get a full year free. This will save you thousands of dollars. You get VIP access and you'll be able to use this along with many other uh, different techniques and methods that are not even included in the college course that are free and uh, easy to access on the uh, platform itself. All right. Now, remember, you have three of the best of the best. Now, these are our best tools not only for picking uh, some nice winners, but for defining these lows and these highs. But because of that, they're very expensive, but that's okay. All right, let's go over the prices here. Normally, if you decided to purchase the college, say in a couple of weeks when we don't have this pre-launch offer, it would be over $16,000. We're gonna slash the price roughly by 10%. We're gonna drop it down to $14,995. You're gonna save over $1,700, okay? But remember, you're also going to get saving thousands of dollars with the full year of the PTS Primo platform. And the best thing is you don't even have to come up with $14,995 because payment plans are available. Pro Trader Strategies has instructed me to tell you that they will establish payment plans, meaning that for a very small discount, for a fraction of the $14,995, you can put down a one-time payment, establish a payment plan, and you can still be up and running and in the very first class. So you don't have to come up with the full price. Either way, a lot of traders we know like to pay in full, but if you don't want to, either way, you're still going to get a full free year of the platform. Now, Pro Trader Strategies has also instructed me, they said a number of students already have maybe one or two of these indicators or possibly have all three. That's okay. They'll still work with you. They'll give you some type of offer or deal with something else if you're interested in becoming a member of this college. So they're very flexible. Give them a call because remember, Invest in yourself. A year from today, you will have wished you became a member of the Buy Low, Sell High College. I just shared with you a number of examples using these three great tools that will be yours, and you can apply them to any market in any time frame. So contact Pro Trader Strategies if you have any questions about pricing. If you have one of these indicators or maybe two already, you can put together some other type of package with them. They're very flexible. They'd be more than willing to work with you and uh, there's absolutely no obligation for giving them a call. You can either email them at uh, protraderstrategies.com or give them a call at area code 310-598-6677. Now, that link you see there is the link that will take you to the info and sign up page. Uh, it's not a live link, but we've just posted a live link in the chat box. So all you have to do is uh, go to the chat box there and click that on and a browser will open up for you. OK, now I'm going to leave this information here. As I stated, if you have any questions, now is the time to ask. Either go to the question and answer box, the little tab there, or click on the uh, chat box and I will answer them to the best of my ability. Uh, someone's asking me, when will the classes start? Well, this is our very first launch of a, of a presentation. 
And so we want to see how many uh, people are interested. Sometimes we're just inundated with people with a particular college. So we have the college start right away because we close it up. So we won't be able to tell. Usually it's in the next two to four weeks that we start the live class, okay? And someone is asking, how long are the live classes? Well, most likely they're two to three hours long. You know, I always start out with colleges saying, oh, mostly likely about one or two hours, but then they always end up being closer to three hours. So I'm gonna say two to three hours, okay? And everything is recorded. If you can't make the live class, I see someone's asking, what if I can't make the live class? Then you will get the recording. But everyone as a student of mine gets my personal email address. You can always you know, email me with any questions anytime you like, and I will answer your questions just as soon as possible, okay? So if you can make the class, that's great, because then you can ask me any question you like. We break it up into different sections, and we pause for different uh, uh, moments to ask questions and, and to go over slides. Uh, but if you can't make it, don't worry. You will get the recording of the class, and then you watch at your own leisure whenever you like. And then you can always email me with any uh, questions that you may have, okay? Uh, someone's asking, will we, will we be covering specific markets? I'll be covering just about every market that I see set up set up currently. The main thing we try to focus is that we try to have as recent examples as possible. I know a lot of you know times you've gone to webinars and you see examples that are a year or two old. I know I showed some older examples here today, but that was because I didn't want to really give away a lot of things that are current. But uh, in the course, we will see things that might have happened that last week and show you how you could have taken advantage of it or maybe still be able to take advantage of it when there are setups being generated. Because believe me, there are setups being generated using these three indicators all of the time. They're always happening. In fact, you may be inundated with too many setups using these three indicators because they're our best of the best. So that's why we included them in this college, okay? Uh, question, do you recommend using the PTSXT and the Primo Secret Breakout Indicator at the same time or scan each separately and use each separately with the PETD? Well, uh, this is a very good student of ours. And uh, without giving anything away, I'll probably be covering that in the course. I, all I would say is in the beginning, when you're just starting out using this, if, you, if you've never traded with any of our tools at all or even our strategies, I always recommend to new students to just stick with one thing at a time. But as I stated, we're going to be sharing with you a great exiting tool, which is a combination of these indicators. And so with that, you'll actually have to use them in conjunction. But I'll go over that a little bit more in detail. I just don't want to give away too much information, but, but thanks for asking. Uh, that's a great question, okay? So um, yes, the, the answer is basically yes and no. <laughs> I'm sorry to, to make it so, uh, uh, you know, uh, uh, non-answerable at this moment. but. Um, Let's see, another question is, what is your email address? Well, that, I will be giving that in the class. I can't give that away now. I only reserve my private email address to uh, uh, students that are of mine that have taken courses. But remember, you can always contact ProTrader Strategies and ask them a question. They help develop all the courses with me and all the colleges. In fact, they're in charge of all the tech support. So anything concerning tech support or data or the platform and anything concerning pricing, I would highly recommend giving them a call because they're the ones that are in charge of that. Uh, remember, we know that this is an expensive, this is probably one of our most expensive packages, but as we stated, you are getting the best of the best. And the best thing is, is that Pro Trader Strategies has said that you can have, uh, you know, usually with, pri with pricing this high, they don't like to have it, but they are going to offer uh, payment plans. So for a small amount, you can still be established and still be up and running. So I would definitely give them a call. Remember, there's no obligation. They would be more than happy to answer any questions you have, either about pricing or about data or about courses. If you already have one or two of these indicators, they'd be, they're very flexible. They'd be more than happy to uh, work something out. But uh, don't feel worried that you're going to be sold anything. They're very flexible and they're there to work for you. And uh, they have trading consultants manning the phones right now. So you can give them a call at 310 598-6677. Okay, if there are no further questions, that brings us to the end. And as we take one last look at our disclaimer, remember, this is a great, great way to really, uh, you know, take advantage of these best of the best indicators because they are specifically designed and developed to identify and to pinpoint these buying areas at the lows and these selling areas at the highs. So if that's the type of trader you are, if you like to really take advantage of these very low inexpensive prices, 
or get out and squeeze as much profit as possible, this is the college for you. That's why we developed this together, myself and ProTrader Strategies, because we know there are a number of students who like to trade that way. So this is the main reason why we put this together. And this is the main reason why you have the best of the best of these tools, okay? Now, as we take one last look at our disclaimer, thank you so much for attending today. And remember, this is being live streamed on YouTube. So if you like this, people watching us on YouTube, be sure to click the thumbs up button or even better to subscribe. You'll be able to get access to all of our videos and to watch many more educational presentations. So as we close, thank you once again for attending. I wish you all the best of luck in trading, but most especially, I look forward to seeing and teaching you all in the new Buy Low, Sell High College. Thank you so much. Have a great day. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.